Hi, welcome back to my channel and today I have another Disney haul for you. So today I've got items from Primark, um, some from uh, 365 Games, I've got one item from eBay and yeah so let's get started with the haul. So I think I'll start with my eBay item. So that is these, it is the Mickey Memories pins from May. So these are like the lovely pastel blue and pink pins. So I wanted these when they came out but I just didn't end up getting them. But I actually managed to get this off eBay for £15 all in, which I thought was a really good price because these retailed at £15. So it's like I got postage for free. So I thought that was a really good price for these. And obviously my craft room is like um, pastel colours so I thought this will look really nice hung up on the wall. So what I like to do with my pins is I like to get these little embroidery frames, put a um, like a matching colour behind them and then put the pins on them. I'm going to spray them gold as well and I thought then I could put the pins on and hang them up in my craft room and they'll look really cute. So that is what I will be doing with those very soon. So I'll give you a close up of these pins so you can see what they actually look like. Okay so here's a closer look at the pins. In fact, I'll take them out of the plastic so you can see them better. Uh, there you go, so you get this Mickey one, Mickey's head. And you can see it looks like the actual plush that you got. I really want this plush, but it's always dead expensive. So if anyone has one that they want to sell for close to retail price, please let me know because I really would like him. And then you get this Oh Boy one, which I really like. It's the pink and the blue. And then you get one which looks like the plush. So I think they are really cute little set of pins there. Okay, so my next couple of items are from Primark. The first thing is this pack of socks. So I really needed a few new socks. I can only seem to find one of every sock. So I definitely needed some new ones. And so these were just £3.50. This is the Minnie Mouse pack. So you've got a pink one, a white one and a blue one and they've all got a little Minnie Mouse on them. So I'll give you a close up of these as well so you can see them a bit better. Okay, so here is a closer look at the socks. So you get this pink one, it's got a little Minnie Mouse on. You get these white ones and then the blue ones. And then on the back shows you what they look like there. So my next couple of items from Primark are actually Christmas items. I know it's only, what are we, in October, but sometimes you need to get them quick in Primark because they go so quickly. So the first one is this Mickey and Minnie bauble. I just thought this was really, really nice. And it was only £6, which I thought was a good price. So we got that because I don't think we've got any Mickey and Minnie decorations for our tree and Alice absolutely my daughter absolutely loves Mickey and Minnie so we got that one I'll give you a close look at it in a second and then we also just picked up this pack of four baubles so I really like these ones because they're red and green and it goes with our theme for Christmas our tree is decorated in red and green so these were four pounds so it makes it a pound each so I just thought they were really nice again I'll give you a closer look at these in a second Okay, so here's a closer look at the Mickey and Minnie bauble. So you see it's got a little Christmas tree in with Mickey and Minnie with presents. I just thought that was a really cute bauble for £6. And then here is the four pack of baubles. So I'll actually take these out so you can see them because you can't see them very well with the glare of the package. So there you go, that is the first one. And it's just red with the Disney logo on it. There you go, that is the second one. It's just green and it says Ho Ho on it with some little snowflakes. And then this is the next one. It's just red with green and white stripes. Then this is the final one. It's just green with a big red bow on it. However, there's a lot of glue on here. So I'm not too impressed with this one. You can see loads of glue where they've glued it on. So you might need to have a good look at these when you buy them. Okay, that is the green one. Okay, so I do have a few more items from Primark, but they're all clothing. One's from my husband and the rest is from my little boy. So I think I'll show you the items from 365 Games next. Um, so the first item is this Cuposket figure. It's from the Sweet Tiny collection. And I think these are made to look like toddler versions of the princesses. 
um, which I love because if you know me I love the animators collection and they also are to make the, the um, princesses look like toddlers so I absolutely love this range so I think I paid £18 or £18.50 for this one on 365 games I think she was on offer they often do offers on the coupon skit so it's worth getting in when they do that and yeah um, she's absolutely gorgeous so I actually picked up the pastel version so with these they always do a normal colour version and they'll do a pastel version and because my craft room is pastel I always try and get the pastel ones although I'm not usually that successful because there's not a lot of pastel versions I can find in the UK so yeah I will get her out of the box now so you can see what she looks like okay so there she is she's super cute she's holding a big um, like pocket watch which is coming up to midnight I just think she looks so cute and I love the pastel colours I think she looks much better in pastel blue than in darker blue so yeah I'll give you a close up of her as well in a second okay so here's a close look of the little Cinderella figure yeah, she's really really cute Cinderella and I also got another one of these figures from 365 games and I got the Tinkerbell one again I managed to get the Tinkerbell one in the pastel colour the pastel ones are actually cheaper than the normal colour on there which is rare again I think I paid about £18 for her I think she was another one that was on offer so let's pick her up and show you what she looks like these do actually come in parts they come in three parts they understand the body and the head and you have to put them together i've actually filmed unboxing videos for this one and the cinderella one um i'm not sure if they'll be up when this goes up it, they might go up a bit later but if they are already up i will link them below for you and here she is out of the box i actually think this one is super cute i think this one is my favorite she's so gorgeous so that's that one so again I'll give you a close-up look at her as well and then here's a closer look at the little Tinkerbell figure and there you go so she's really cute and she's holding a little little um, reel of thread I just think she's a really cute little figure I love her okay so the next few items in this haul are all clothing items so the first piece of clothing is actually for my husband and it is this marvel hoodie uh, this is from primark and this was just 12 pounds so it's just a normal red hoodie but it just has the little marvel on there logo thing on there so that's for him then from a little boy we picked him up this little spider-man sweatshirt and this one was five pounds from Primark then also from a little boy we picked him up some little Mickey Mouse jeans how cute are those you can see the little embroidered Mickey Mouse here and these were just eight pounds which I think is really good he needed a new pair of jeans so I love the fact that it's got a little Mickey on there and then the final item I got for my little boy was just this free pack of um, Lion King tops. These are really, really cute. These were £8 for a pack of three. I just think these are really nice. So this one has Simba and Yazi one and it says ready to rule. And then I really like the next one, which is like, looks like a jungle scene and it's got all the characters on. It's got Simba. Got Simba, Timon, Pumba, Nyazu, and Mufasa on there as well. So I just thought that was a really nice one. And then the final t shirt is this grey one, which just has Simba on, which I thought was really nice as well. There we go. Okay, so that is everything in this haul. I think it is a sh this is a short one today. It's not as long as some of the other ones that I've had, but I thought I might as well film it all now rather than wait till I get a few more things. I thought this was enough to do a little haul. So yeah, I hope you have enjoyed it. If you have, please give it a like. Don't forget to subscribe. And I hope to see you again soon for another Disney haul. Bye.